My name is Amberly Isabella. I'm a designer here at Gensler in the Lifestyle Studio, which primarily focuses mixed use retail and hospitality design. I do everything from working with finished palettes, um, furniture selection, to more architectural components, 3D computer modeling. I love what I do. I never thought of doing anything else. I have my Bachelor of Arts of Interior Design. I'm so proud to be, you know, to attend the University of Kentucky. It's funny because, um, you know, born and raised Connecticut, people often ask me, you know, why, why did you go to Kentucky? You know, what, what made Kentucky for you? I love the community that um, Kentucky exudes and the enthusiasm. I'm a really big basketball fan too, so it was a big draw. It was a good value and it was a good fit. The College of Design as a whole really prepared me academically for everything that I encounter on a daily basis. But I certainly found that it's my extracurricular activities that really put me ahead of my peers as far as just having a level of leadership. Dance Blue was the number one most rewarding experience of my entire life. It's my proudest accomplishment and it has taught me so much. First and foremost, it gave me a good perspective just on life in general. The second thing would probably just be the smarts of leadership. You know, you learn how to handle a team. After I graduated, I felt like I learned all this stuff and I just wanted to share it with people. I wrote a book, it's called um, The Little Book on How to Become Kind of a Big Deal. It's actually more of a journal for your leadership team. I just had such a great experience. I would love for, for somebody else to have that experience. I never visited Kentucky before I decided to come. It was sort of on a whim, um, but it was the best decision that I ever made. I am Kathy Black, and I'm a supervising producer and music booker for CBS News and for The Early Show. Every day is different. We're all news producers and reporters first, but on a day when things are calm and there's not a lot going on, we work in our specialized areas. So I'm responsible for booking all of our concerts. I book all of the talent. I just booked Jennifer Hudson and Bruno Mars and um, working on Lady Gaga. So it's, it's always something different and I really enjoy it. This has really been a dream come true for me. And I'm proud when people ask me, where did you go to school? I'm like, the University of Kentucky. You know, I bleed blue, I'm a wildcat. The College of Communications really honed in on each student and the individual things they were interested in. And that's what I really appreciated. It makes no difference what you're interested in. UK has something for everybody and I think that's what really drew me. It's a campus that offers so much for everybody. There's always something going on and it's very inclusive. The classes were amazing. There's a lot of things that I learned at UK that I now use, especially working in a national climate like, like this where we're, I'm competing with NBC and ABC and and the major networks. You really have to find that special thing about a person that, that, that's going to help you lock into them. And I think that's what UK prepared me for. It was just the basic way to communicate with people. I think one of my most memorable stories that I covered was the Michael Jackson trial. So every exclusive we got with um, Jermaine and, and with the family and, and Janet and Tito came through the relationship I built with them. And I actually drew a lot of my of what I learned at UK and brought it to, to the trial. I honestly wouldn't be here today at CBS News, um, a number one network in the country, if it weren't for UK, because they gave me the foundation. The education you walk away with is gonna offer you the opportunity to go anywhere in the world and do anything in the world. The sky's the limit. My name is Matt Cutts, one of the first 100 employees at Google. I work in search quality. I'm the head of the web spam team. They do their homework. So one thing that Google cares about that a lot of companies don't pay as much attention to is their is GPA. And so I was able to say I had a 4.0 at UK and I remember that impressed them, you know, because they looked through the transcript and they saw the courses that I'd done. And so I think that helped a little bit in the interview process. I got a Singletary scholarship, but in addition to that there was also, for example, a Gaines Fellowship in the Humanities which was really good because then you don't just learn about computers and engineering, you also learn about you know, the humanities and you learn about the softer side of things and the arts and that was really useful. We get emails from people who say, I was having a heart attack and I typed in heart attack symptoms and I got the right answer really fast and it let me go to the emergency room. So we've literally had people come and say, Google saved my life and that's the sort of thing where you just feel like, I can't believe I'm a part of this, I can't believe I'm helping and making this difference. You're a part of, of web culture. You're a part of something that's changed the way the world works. You know, people can work more efficiently. They can work better. 
you can get a world-class education at the University of Kentucky. I learned that because what you put in, in terms of time, research, working with professors, is, is what you get back out. There's no reason you can't get as good an education at UK as anywhere else in the world. You'll look good in blue.